and it's a 3.7 V6. Uh, the valve that I showed you over there was the 2.7 V6. So what we're trying to show you is how we can keep this from happening to your engine by using the VG chemical and doing that every 10, 15, 20,000 miles, kind of expensive, but it's going to be a lot cheaper than, well, we're going to be around 1,800 hours to fix this vehicle at this point, might go up from there. And we're going to take the, get down inside of here and we're going to do what's called walnut blasting. What we're going to do is, is we're going to use pulverized walnuts and we're going to actually go in there and we're going to blast this carbon off of this intake valve and then the thing has a vacuum and we suck it all back out. And this right here is a fuel injector and what happens is over time is when this fuel injector sprays gasoline fuel that you get at the gas station has cleaners in it and would keep this intake valve clean. Positive crankcase ventilation and EGR exhaust gas recirculation which means they're recirculating the exhaust gas and crankcase vapors through this and what's happening is is this valve would get clogged or carboned up. What the manufacturers have done is they've actually moved this fuel injector directly into the cylinder. Awesome idea, very peppy fuel economy, very efficient way to distribute the fuel. The problem is, is this intake valve is no longer getting that cleaning from the fuel injector. So what is happening on, and we're going to talk about what vehicles here in just a little bit, but these, this intake valve is now getting carboned up. Now this right here I'm going to show you is a brand new intake valve, it's never even been in an engine. And notice how clean and shiny it is. Uh, but we, what you to see is, on these, some of these direct injection engines, this is an intake valve right here. 